What's up guys, welcome back to AutoHeads. Thanks for checking out today's video. Today is gonna be an exclusive, premiere, first look, whatever you wanna call it. I looked at YouTube, I cannot find any YouTube videos that cover how to install a tailgate assist on a 2021 F-150. So I'm proud to be able to show you guys a first look on how to do this. It's almost the same, I'm gonna be honest, but there is one little thing that you gotta change up to make this work for your F-150. Let's get started with the unboxing. All right, this is what's included in the kit. You're gonna have your little mounting bracket here. This goes in the bottom portion. You're gonna have your hex key, which is included. A little screw with Loctite in it, which is really nice. Nice little feature there. And then you're gonna have your top mounting bracket. And then you're gonna have the piston itself. This is made by DZ. Really, really popular tailgate assist. Probably the most popular on Amazon. I'll put a link to this in the description for you guys to find. And then it's also gonna include some really nice color instructions, but it does not include how to get this to work on a 2021 F-150, but that's why I'm here. All right, tools needed for this job, not too many here. 10 millimeter socket and a socket wrench. You're gonna also need a hex key. This is a five millimeter hex bit. So just a hex bit, hex key, whatever you got available. And then you're gonna need either a flathead screwdriver or some kind of a pry tool. This is the Trisvalto tool that I use for everything. And then this is not really needed, but if you have PB Blaster, it wouldn't hurt to hit some of the bolts before you start unscrewing things just to ensure you don't strip anything. All right, first step is to remove the tailgate wire here. You can use a flathead screwdriver or whatever you have to kind of pry at that flat metal piece. Just pry it, then push the tailgate up with your knee to give yourself a little bit of slack on that wire, and the wire should pop right out. Grab your 10 millimeter socket and socket wrench, and we're gonna be loosening, not removing, we're gonna be loosening this bolt. Just, I'd say, I don't know, a couple millimeters so you can fit in the mounting bracket, but I'll show you guys exactly what I mean in a second. So just loosen that up so you can basically unscrew it with your fingers and then move on to this top bolt. You're gonna remove that one completely. This is where we're gonna put the bolt provided with the Loctite that DZ provided. Real quick guys, if you wanna follow my build for my 2021 F-150 and check out tons of videos that I have in my 2016 F-150 build, please consider hitting that subscribe button. Let me know what you guys wanna see next on the 2021 F-150 build. I'd really appreciate it. Hit me up in the comments. All right, after loosening that one bolt and completely removing the other, we're gonna put the first mounting plate in. You'll see here, I just kinda slide the plate over the washer and over the bolt. I'll get you another angle here. Drop it in behind your loosened factory washer and bolt, then grab the provided bolt with the blue Loctite and begin screwing it in with your five millimeter hex bit or your hex key. Then you're gonna grab your 10 millimeter socket and socket wrench and tighten that factory bolt all the way down. Next up, we're gonna grab the T50 torque key that DZ provided in the kit, and we're gonna remove the factory bolt that was holding up that tailgate wire. Then you're gonna grab that other mounting plate. Make sure this flat edge is against this flat edge on the truck, and you're gonna grab the existing bolt that you just removed put it over the bracket and reinstall that bolt. Quick little tip that I would suggest you guys doing is I actually like to push this bracket and kind of angle it slightly towards the truck, not much, just slightly. That's gonna allow that bracket to not move over time. In my experience, these tailgate assists over a long period of time, over you know years, you'll start to see that bracket slowly creep its way towards the rear of the truck. If you cant it a little bit like this, that slight angle is gonna keep that bracket locked in place. All right, let's put on the shock itself. This is gonna be the bottom and this is gonna be the top end. The top end's a little fatter, the bottom end is a little more narrow, a little more skinny. All right, we're gonna start by popping the smaller end of the shock into the bottom knuckle. 
Now, you do have to expand this shock almost fully. I've seen on other videos, people will suggest, you know, grabbing one end and, and grabbing the other end with a vice grip and pulling it and gnarling it all up. I'm gonna show you guys a quick little tip on how to expand this shock without doing any kind of damage to the shock itself. Once the bottom end of the shock is installed into the knuckle, you can easily grab the back end and expand the shock. It's really easy to do it like this and you can make little minor adjustments ensuring that the top end of the knuckle goes perfectly in. Second to last step is you're gonna take that tailgate wire, put the flat metal piece directly over the bolt, push it in. You're gonna have to lift up the tailgate with your knee just slightly, push it in, slide it down, and we're almost done. This part is what separates the 2021s from other F-150 installs. This little tie down bracket or whatever you wanna call it is what's preventing the 2021 F-150 from being able to work. But it's very, very easy to remove. Just take your five millimeter torque bit that we've been using the whole time and remove the two bolts. It comes out very, very easy. If you don't remove this, the tailgate assist will not work. Let me know in the comments, guys, is this in your 2021 F-150 or is this just an option? Honestly, the truck is just so new that I don't know. I don't have much experience with, with seeing these. But if you just remove this little tie down bracket, that's what I'm gonna call it, then it works absolutely perfect. Nothing gets in the way. What I did is I just took this and I put it in my glove box with some of my towing accessories. There is a nice plastic bag. This fit in perfect. Also, once you unscrew this bracket, just take the screws and screw them right back in. That way you don't lose them and also prevent any kind of water from getting in there. All right, guys, that is it for today's install. I appreciate you guys following along my 2021 F-150 build. This is one of my favorite accessories for any 2015 to 2021 F-150. I have this on my 2016 F-150. It's one of those things that a family member can really appreciate too. My wife loves to be able to open up this tailgate with one hand, put the groceries in with the other, handle the kids. You know, any kind of free hand you can have with kids is a lifesaver. And it's also a safety issue. If you have someone that's tall enough, like a kid that's tall enough to open up that latch by themselves, it comes down in a hurry and it is not light. As always, guys, thank you so much for checking out my channel. And here are some other videos you can watch next. See ya.